teacher and I run. I put in 100% in everything that I do. It's just not in my nature to pull back. I want to be exceptional in all the components of my life. To be a successful teacher, you have to invest time into learning the kids and to learning what makes them tick. I'm so nosy. I ask a ton of questions, and the more nuances that I ask, the more they tell. And sure, I want to know what you have for breakfast, but I want to know how you're set up for the day. You're printing, you're laminating, you're researching, you're photocopying, you're dealing with broken arms. It becomes a juggling act, and so when you add in coaching or you add in family life and you add in heading different organizations at school, there's never enough time. You have to make the time. You have to make it a priority. If you put in the effort and you're nice to people, everything will be good. I grew up watching my dad go out for these nightly runs. He ran every single day. He ran in the snow. He ran in the rain. He did it for clarity. And then he walked in the door and he was the best dad. I love what he has instilled in me. I love what he's taught me. I want to be a positive role model for my two boys. I'm not running for the praise of others. I'm running to represent how to bring out the best in yourself. I internally battled body image a lot as a young girl. And I never really had the guidance or the support in how to get past it. It wasn't until I found running that it all made sense for me, that I felt like I was using my body for what it was meant to do. I'm a Girls on the Run coach and this is my second season. Girls on the Run uses running as an outlet for the girls to feel strong and feel successful by being able to lead that and by talking from experience, I'm able to be a role model. There's a sign in my class that says, I'm not telling you it's gonna be easy, I'm telling you it's gonna be worth it. And when I'm running, they believe in what I'm doing with them because they know that I practice what I preach. I love my life. I love it, I wouldn't have it any other way.